Hey guys, it's Alex with Your Biz Tank. I'm one of the co-owners of this real estate marketing company, and our passion is to help you connect the dots of your real estate marketing strategy, save you a little money, and be more effective in the end. All right, so today I really want to talk about auto posting to social media and we're big fans of reusing content meaning if you're gonna spend time you know creating a blog or posting that thing to Facebook that you're reusing it in different ways I mean if you have a you know a, a marketing strategy and a goal in mind and you write that blog you know trying to reach a specific audience you know we're gonna reuse that blog in a couple of different ways on more than one site and maybe 10 or 15 different ways in, in the end. So what I want you to think about is reusing content's different and auto posting is something totally different. So I want to talk about auto posting today and why we um, kind of frown on it when you let it kind of do the work for you. And here are three reasons and three tips on why auto posting is something to rethink before you do it. All right, so tip number one is that each social site is totally different. I mean, if you want to pause this video and go ahead and hop on over to Twitter, Twitter is going to look completely different than Facebook, right? And then if you go over to LinkedIn, LinkedIn looks totally different as well. So each site has a different strategy, a different theme that works better on one site than the other. And make sure that you recognize this because most people, not most people, but some people use, you know, one social posting tool. And that one tool, they'll compose that one message, that one way, and send that same exact message to Twitter and send it to, um, you know, Facebook and LinkedIn and all of the sites that one way everywhere. And that's not the most effective way to utilize these social scheduling tools and social media in general. All right, so site number two, or tip number two, is the way you post content there is totally different too. What's more effective on Twitter might not always work the best on Facebook. So be conscious of how you post and what you post it to. Some sites can, you know, can handle the overlap. So sometimes the way you post to Facebook can overlap to the way you post it to LinkedIn. Sometimes the way you tweet might look okay and work on Facebook. So it just kind of depends on what it is. But know that most of the time it might be better to post it, you know, individually to these sites in their own unique ways. The way you tag somebody, hashtags are used differently. Um, the way links are presented. Make sure you know how it looks on your page and your profile. So each site is different and the way you post content is totally different. The last thing I want to talk about is that each site is good for different things. You know, like I said, the way you use hashtags, the way you tag people um, in the post it, is totally different. For example, specifically on Facebook, there are different ways to post a link. Sometimes we'll take the actual picture that you know, highlights that blog or highlights that thing we're posting to Facebook and we'll upload the image. Then above that in the text, you know, we'll write something and we'll have the, um, the link to that blog or that page of the website somewhere and we'll post a link that way. Sometimes we'll also just upload the link to Facebook and then, you know, let Facebook convert it to how it converts links currently. So sometimes we'll play with that strategy a little bit. Like I said, Facebook's different, Twitter's different, so make sure you pay attention to what you're posting, how you're posting, and and things like that. The last thing I want to mention is that, you know, the time, the type of post, how often you post, all of these things are different factors on all sites. So again, before you click post everywhere or auto post to everything, think again. Still use these scheduling tools to schedule out your social media perfectly fine. If you want to take that one link and then just spend an extra, you know, two minutes posting it differently to other sites, that's fine too. That would be perfect. So again, just caution yourself a little bit. Be more aware of the fact that it's different and you'll be more effective in the end, I promise you. All right, if you have any questions on this topic, let me know, but reuse your content, just be careful auto-posting it. All right, I'm Alex with Your Biz Tank, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys.